everyone and welcome back to the PageRage video tutorial. Today we will be creating a custom layout in honor of National Pretzel Day. So let's get started. The first step in creating a layout is to make sure that you have PageRage correctly installed on your computer. The second step is to run a Google image search on what it is you are searching for. So go to Google Images and today we are searching for pretzels. And as you can see here, this is what my search came up with for me. And today looks specifically for images that are 400 pixels in width for both your left and right curtain. And also keep in mind that you will need to make sure that you have permission to use these images as well. Once you have chosen your images, save them to your computer. And now you can go to pagerage.com. So once you get to the home page, you will click on this button, create your own layout, and it will take you to this page you see here. So we will be skipping the first step today because we will be not incorporating any colors for our background, left curtain, right curtain, or title bar. So click next step. And we will be loading our images that we saved here. So click on this drop down menu. We'll start with left curtain. Click load. Select your left curtain image that you saved. And I want this image to continue all the way down the left curtain. So click this tile box right here. And I want to make it just a little transparent. And next we'll go to right curtain. Click load. Select your right curtain image that you saved. And I want this image to go a little bit more to the left, so just click on the image with your cursor and just drag to where you want it positioned on the right curtain. And I want this image to tile as well, so click this box. And make it just a little transparent so it matches the left curtain. Finally, we will be loading our title bar image. Click load. Select your title bar image, and there you go. And let's just make this a little transparent as well. So since we've finished uploading all of our images that we need, click Next Step. And we will be selecting a different color than what they have given us here. So click this box. And we're looking for a dark brown, so we'll go with this color here. Click Next Step and finishing touches, naming our layout, do National Pretzel Day. And make sure that this box is selected so it shows up on your Facebook page. And you can choose to make it um, a little bit transparent, but we'll just keep it to the top. And you will click Save and Publish. And just give it a few seconds for it to load. and our newly created pretzel layout was success successfully loaded to our Facebook page. And if you want to see your newly created layout, you can go to Facebook right away, click this link. And also, it gives you a bunch of codes here if you want to share with friends. And if you liked this pretzel layout that we created today, you can also go to dailyfacebooklayouts.com and Click on this layout right here, and it'll set it up to your Facebook profile um, so you can have a National Pretzel Day layout. And that's it for today, so stay tuned for more video tutorials on PageRage.